Three Eye Atlas has all kinds of surprises. Uh, look like a tail is kind of starting to form. Scientists don't really know why. Right now, a 73 trillion pound object is hurtling through our solar system at 124,000 miles per hour. And it's not from here. Scientists detected extreme negative polarization in its light signature, something never seen in any comet before. The object's trajectory aligned within five degrees of Earth's orbital plane and passed suspiciously close to Mars with timing so precise that the probability is less than one in a million. The object is uh, quite large and uh, it's also aligned in its path with uh, a plane of the planets around the Sun. Harvard astrophysicist Avi Loeb assigns a 30 to 40 percent probability this isn't entirely natural. Even more unsettling, during the recent government shutdown, NASA's data feeds went dark, precisely when this object made its closest approach to Mars. 3 I Atlas has shattered every rule we thought governed interstellar objects. Here's what should terrify you most. If this object is artificial, it's been watching us. Think about it. Most important question is whether it could be technological or it's just natural. Hopefully, we'll know more within the coming days. Three I Atlas approached from the direction where extraterrestrial observers could have detected Earth's transits across the sun. According to Loeb's calculations, any civilization within a 10-degree cone from our ecliptic plane could have discovered our solar system through transit surveys, just like we find exoplanets. They'd know exactly where our planets are when they orbit and which one harbors life. The object's five-degree alignment puts it right in that detection zone. If someone sent this probe after observing Earth, they've been watching us for potentially thousands of years, waiting for the right moment to arrive. If you're fascinated by space mysteries like this, hit that subscribe button. We're tracking this object in real time. For months, people have been asking the same terrifying questions about 3i Atlas. The answers are far more disturbing than you might expect. This interstellar visitor has seven documented anomalies that scientists can't fully explain. Unlike the cigar-shaped Oumuamua or the typical comet Borisov, this object defies categorization. At over 73 trillion pounds, 3i Atlas is roughly 6 million times heavier than SpaceX's Starship, our most powerful rocket. This mass estimate comes from Harvard researchers who noticed something bizarre. Despite visible outgassing creating a cloud around it, the object's trajectory barely changes. Normally, when comets release gas, they get pushed around like a balloon letting out air, not this one. It's so massive that these jets barely affect its path. Here's where it gets stranger. According to our understanding of interstellar space density, there simply isn't enough rocky material out there to deliver an object this massive to our inner solar system. Avi Loeb calculated that based on the known distribution of matter between stars, we should have seen hundreds of smaller objects before encountering something this huge. We haven't. As Loeb stated, there's not enough rocky material in interstellar space to deliver such a giant rock into the inner solar system over the past decade. The timing raises even more questions. On October 3rd, 2025, 3i Atlas passed within 18 million miles of Mars, close enough for our rovers and orbiters to get unprecedented images. The Perseverance rover captured something moving across the Martian sky, a slanted streak that didn't match normal star trails. But here's the kicker. Just as this historic flyby occurred, many NASA websites and data feeds went silent due to the government shutdown. The timing feels awfully convenient when the world's scientists were desperate for real-time updates. What we did manage to capture before the blackout is deeply puzzling. The object appears elongated, more like Oumuamua than a typical round comet. It lacks the dramatic tail we'd expect from something this active. Instead, it's surrounded by a diffuse coma of ionized gas that behaves unlike anything in our databases. The chemical composition adds another layer of mystery. Scientists detected cyanide and carbon monoxide, not unusual for comets. But they also found evidence suggesting the environment around 3i Atlas resembles Mars-like conditions rather than typical comet-forming regions. This hints the object might have originated from a planetary surface, not the icy depths of space where comets are born. The object's behavior around the Sun defies expectations too. On September 25th, a coronal mass ejection, basically a solar storm, struck 3i Atlas directly. 
Scientists expected this blast of charged particles to dramatically alter the comet, maybe even break it apart. Follow-up observations on September 27th and October 2nd showed nothing dramatic. No fragmentation, no sudden tail formation, just gradual expansion of its envelope. It's almost as if the object is more resilient than any natural comet should be. Here's what really keeps scientists up at night, the polarization anomaly. When sunlight bounces off dust particles around comets, it creates a specific pattern we can measure. Every comet we've studied shows positive polarization at large viewing angles. 3i Atlas shows negative polarization at minus 2.77% at a phase angle of 6.4 degrees, more extreme than any comet ever observed. This means the dust around it is fundamentally different from anything in our solar system. The particles might be rougher, more irregular, or made of materials we've never encountered. The trajectory itself tells a story. Unlike random space debris, 3i Atlas moves on a path aligned almost perfectly with our solar system's plane, where all the planets orbit. The probability of this happening by chance is 0.002, or 1 in 500. Then consider it passed close to Mars, will pass near Jupiter on March 16, 2026, and arrived at just the right time to encounter multiple planets. The combined probability of these coincidences is less than one in a million. Think about this from an engineering perspective. If you wanted to study multiple planets efficiently, you'd design a trajectory that stays close to the ecliptic plane. You'd time your arrival to maximize planetary encounters. That's exactly what 3i Atlas is doing. The object will pass within 33.5 million miles of Jupiter, close enough for detailed observations if it carries any instruments. As Loeb points out, if the trajectory was designed by extraterrestrial intelligence, the five-degree inclination makes perfect sense. It's the optimal angle to observe transits of main belt asteroids, which have an opening angle of about 10 degrees above and below the ecliptic. Some scientists propose an even wilder possibility. Dr. Suzanne Fenner suggests objects like 3i Atlas might be planetary seeds. Her simulations show that massive interstellar objects falling into young solar systems could jumpstart planet formation. Instead of taking millions of years to grow from dust, planets could form rapidly around these ready-made cores. If true, some of Jupiter's mass might have come from an ancient interstellar visitor. The speed is another red flag. Currently racing at 37 miles per second relative to Mars, 3i Atlas will accelerate to 42 miles per second near the Sun. That's 150,000 miles per hour, fast enough to circle Earth in 10 minutes. This isn't unusual for interstellar objects, but combined with its mass, it represents tremendous kinetic energy. If this were artificial, it would represent technology far beyond human capability. The size estimates keep growing as we get better data. Initial observations suggested something modest, maybe a few hundred feet across. Now we're looking at a nucleus roughly three miles wide, that's three miles of solid material, not counting the surrounding gas cloud. For perspective, that's larger than the asteroid that killed the dinosaurs. Imagine something the size of a small mountain flying through space at speeds that would cross the United States in under two minutes. European Space Agency's spacecraft are our last hope for answers. While NASA went dark, ESA's, Mars Express, and ExoMars Trace Gas Orbiter continued observations. The upcoming JUICE spacecraft will intercept 3i Atlas in November 2025, though data transmission delays mean we won't see results immediately. These observations could finally reveal whether the object has any unusual surface features or internal structures. What makes this truly terrifying isn't any single anomaly, it's the pattern. Every measurement pushes the boundaries of what's naturally possible, the mass is too large, the composition too strange, the timing too perfect, the trajectory too precise. Scientists use the term black swan event, something so unlikely it forces us to reconsider our assumptions. Avi Loeb puts it bluntly, those insisting 3i Atlas is purely natural must explain all seven anomalies through natural processes. So far, no one has. The object seems to glow in ways regular comets don't. Some predict it might evaporate dramatically or break into pieces near perihelion in late October. Others think it might surprise us again by remaining intact. 
the most unsettling possibility? That Three-Eye Atlas represents what Loeb calls a Trojan horse, technology masquerading as a natural object. The perfect camouflage would be to look almost like a comet, but not quite. Just different enough that careful observation reveals the truth, but similar enough to avoid immediate detection. Consider the implications. If an advanced civilization wanted to study solar systems, what better way than sending probes that look like natural objects? They could gather data for millions of years drifting between stars, occasionally passing through systems like ours. The five-degree orbital alignment would make sense if the probe was designed to encounter multiple planets efficiently. The unusual resilience to solar storms would be expected from advanced materials. We're not saying 3i Atlas is definitely artificial. The scientific consensus still leans toward natural origins. But the accumulation of anomalies has reached a point where even conservative scientists are asking uncomfortable questions. This object is forcing us to confront possibilities we've always relegated to science fiction. As 3i Atlas approaches the sun, we're running out of time to study it. By December 19, 2025, it will pass 167 million miles from Earth, our last good viewing opportunity before it disappears forever into interstellar space. Whatever secrets it holds, we have just weeks to uncover them. After that, it becomes another mystery lost to the cosmic dark. The universe just got a lot stranger and potentially a lot more crowded. Whether 3i Atlas is natural or artificial, it's shown us that interstellar visitors can be far more massive, complex, and mysterious than we imagined. The next one might be even more unusual. And if this one taught us anything, it's that we need to be ready. If this video opened your eyes to the mysteries lurking in our solar system, hit that like button and subscribe for updates as we track 3i Atlas toward the sun. Drop a comment with your theory about what this object really is and share this with someone who thinks space is boring. This will change their mind.